Welcome back, and today's the day Espa comes back with her English single, Better Things, which should be starting right about now. It made me think where we're going into the teaser. the look and styling and promo they've had for this comeback. I've heard this part of it. It's a lot softer than I thought it would be. The harmonies and vocals in the background here. Riding on a giant fish. Oh, they're on their bragging. They're bragging now. that you No I'm sorry I'm sorry That's about big girls making money That's why you're number one fan now you can only see me as a Will I ever go back I love this deeper voice Will I ever pull up on watch and see but that especially Karina is using here Okay, I want to know what we're leading into. I have a feeling this is leading into the lore and potentially the next villain. I just want to know what it is. We need the next mini album. Last I heard, I don't know. It's going back and forth between mini album and full album that they're coming out with potentially this year. We need that. We need to see the continuation. As far as the song, a lot softer. Of course, I had a feeling based on everything I've seen is going to have that tropical kind of sound to it. Which, if you've watched before, you know that's hit or miss for me. But it was a lot softer than I thought it was. However, the vocals that they were delivering in it, the harmonies, and then Karina's deep vocals during that drop, which I wish we would have had a little bit more of that change up. But I guess it makes sense that we didn't. Since this is a push into the US market, it's it's better to play it on the safe side. Keep it Keep things a little bit more simple. But I'm glad we still did have that touch of the signature Espa style.
style that we've come to know with a switch up. Yeah, overall, I think I like this one better. Of course, I never hated Life's Too Short. I actually enjoy Life's Too Short. A lot of people don't. I think this one is better than that, though. I enjoyed this one. Of course, going on my playlist, I'm curious to see how it does. Hopefully, it will do well. Once again, they looked amazing. I love the styling, the concept that they went for with this. Love the music video and their vocals. It, it was soft. I keep going back to that. The song was soft and their vocals just carried. It's a relaxing song. I guess a very chill, relaxing, laid back song with just great vocals throughout it and that change up with the deeper vocals coming in. That's definitely my favorite part of it. Of course, they're doing some bragging in this. Nothing wrong with that. But yeah, overall, not as, as it stands right now, not my favorite ESPA release this year. I still think I'm in a happy or welcome to my world has that title, but I'm not disappointed with this. Going on my playlist, I like it better than Life's Too Short, and I enjoyed Life's Too Short. I think this one is the better English single. Overall, I'm excited to see how this does. I'm excited to hear this in person when I attend their concert next Friday, one week from now. But let me know what you thought about it. I enjoyed it. I enjoyed everything about this comeback, and I want to see where we're leading to in the next chapter, which hopefully starts soon. Let me know what you thought. I'm going to end this video. I will see you in the next one.